this thing can uh, you can lock its individual joints so that So this is your dissertation, Dennis? Yeah, that, you just walked off of my dissertation. <laughs> tell, tell us a little about this. Okay, so uh, this is uh, a bracing system to help individuals with paraplegia walk. Uh, basically it combines mechanical orthosis with FNS, functional electrical stimulation. Um, so this brace uses hydraulics. Um, there's six solenoid valves and these are uh, double acting hydraulic cylinders. Basically it couples the hips, it can lock the hip or free the hip. So it basically varies the constraints of the hip to stabilize the person from falling forward, um, basically prevents uh, medial lateral uh, uh, movement. Um, overall, it, it's, the goal is to minimize the energy consumption of the user so they can walk for longer distances uh, and a longer duration. Did you have a particular inspiration for this? Or this, uh... Uh, this guy was the inspiration for it. <laughs> <laughs> um, there's also uh, a knee constraint here which locks and unlocks the knee at certain points in the gait. So when you're in single or double uh, stance, either foot's on the ground, then it locks the knee so you don't collapse under your weight. When you want to swing, it unlocks, so you're allowed to shorten your leg to, to swing through. Um, so there's also work being done on a new modified knee mechanism which uses uh, MR fluid, magnetorheological fluid, so it actually changes the stiffness of the knee. So it allows you for, allows for shock absorption. And also there's another mechanism being uh, built for the ankle too. It's not applied here, but it's a constraint. It locks, unlocks the ankle and also provides variable damping. Great, thanks. Yep, no problem.